So I made Victor Webb and Yama 511 to prove he'd be flipping burgers. He's not even in the league yet, but we're going to be hate watching anyway. As you can see, he's putting up some very nice stats going into his sixth season. And he's a literal demigod with a 99 three ball. And he's got 94 ball. <laughs> All right, this is kind of crazy. I forgot to mention he's already won an NBA championship and an MVP. So making him 511 is going to expose who he really is, which I think the best comparison would be Lakers Isaiah Thomas. So let's go ahead and put that to the test. Well, the MVP wasn't Victor. That's probably due to him being 15 inches shorter, or he's actually getting exposed for not being that good of a basketball player, which is what we're seeing right now. He somehow made all defensive first team, and the Jazz aren't even in the play-in tournament. Victor dropped a solid 25, 10, and 4. Don't know how he got 10 rebounds as a 5'11 guard, but I guess I'll let it slide. I mean, he has the rebounding badges, but I mean, listen, he's 5'11. He's doing his thing. And the Thunder win the championship. DJ Wagner, finals MVP. Okay, I know it says minus 3 overall, but he actually went up 1 overall because he was a 94 at shooting guard. Listen, am I worried about Tony Rowan? No, I'm not, so we'll be fine. All right, and DJ Wagner's your MVP again, not Victor. Let's see if he made an all-NBA team. I mean, listen, you're not going to be out DeJounte Murray or Mikey Williams, and the Jazz just snuck into the play-in tournament. Victor's still getting those 10 rebounds a game, but it's not mattering much to win in basketball games. And they're actually going to have a chance to go to the playoffs. Victor with 22, 10, and 4 getting carried by Bronny. And they just took down the Blazers, so they're going to the playoffs. Now we got to play OKC in the first round, who has the MVP, Nasir Cunningham, and Josh Giddy. It's a step. Oh my, oh my, oh my God. As I went down the line, I realized this team has five 90s in their starting lineup. Well, Victor, I'm sorry. You're not beating this team, bro. Yeah, that, that's tough. Yeah, I don't think anyone's beating that team. I don't think we're ever going to come close to winning the championship. That is insane. Why does Victor just keep going up and overall? He's not supposed to be getting better at 5'11". But again, we're not worried about Ish Schmidt. So on to the next season. Let's see what happens. All right. Okay. Victor looks kind of crazy with those swole ass arms and he's 5'11". Maybe all the inches he lost went down to his arms. I don't know. And he actually made all NBA third team. We got to give you a slight round of applause there. That's not bad for Ish Smith. And the Jazz are the third seed in the playoffs. They actually might make a run. And the Grizzlies still have Jaw, so this will be tough. And they were up 2-0 and blew four straight games. Meaning they're going to go ahead and lose this in six. Victor shooting eight for 18. Four turnovers, man. A rough game. We'll go to submit the playoffs and the Rockets won the championship. I'm surprised the, the Thunder didn't win it. Again, Victor just keeps going up and over all. Bronny and Victor are still on the team. Victor's got two more years to stop playing like Jody Meeks. Or I'm going to send in the job application and get him the first shift at Burger King. Preferably the day shift because I don't like feeling like a zombie. So we'll give him the day shift. We'll be nice. Everyone on that Thunder team is just winning MVP. And Victor did not win Defensive Player of the Year again. It was McKenzie. But he got all NBA second team. Not bad for Jody Meeks. And the Jazz are the eighth seed. That's upsetting. But they're actually going to get out of here. So they'll actually be in the playoffs. So they're going to play the Spurs in the first round. Victor giving his normal cardio stats 26 and 10. And the Spurs have a good ass team with Xavier Booker, Ron Holland, and Nick Smith. This team's stacked. We got a close one here. The Jazz were actually down 3 0 and have brought it all the way to a game seven. Bronny with the ball here, trying to drive in. Got really nothing with the pull-up. Mitty missed it. Rebound sharp, going back up with it. Found and won. So not only is Victor just 5'11", he's also getting bailed out by his own team in a close game. Smith using the screen with the fadeaway. Mitty, that's a tough shot. Victor rolling to the basket. Are they going to post up Victor? Victor in the post, 5'11". He got it. Oh, my God. Maybe those 15 inches actually didn't matter. Victor with the ball, isoing, hitting the spin move. Hit another spin move. Driving and took it. 5'11", Victor. Proving all the haters wrong. I can't even hate watch. Book not off the screen. There's no way that goes in. Okay, that's game. And Victor with an amazing game seven performance in the first round, dropping 40 and 10. We're going to the second round. Now we got to play the Kings who have Luka. Okay, and Porzingis. And Victor and the Jazz are going to be going out in six games. Victor played a good game. 35, 6, and 4. I can't even hate watch that. He played good. And the Thunder are going to win the championship. Jackson Finals MVP. Well, Victor's got one year left to prove he's not an off-brand Alec Burks. Let's go ahead and see if he can do it. Okay, and Mikey Williams is the MVP, by the way, looks nothing like him. And Victor was able to get himself back to win a Defensive Player of the Year. And for the first time, he made All-NBA First Team. I can't even hate on that. But the Jazz are the ninth seed, so they're going to be fighting. Well, they won't be fighting that hard because they're going home. Victor only with 15, 9, and 7. Rough game. Well, that was Victor's final attempt to actually make something of himself. I guess we'll clock him into the day shift. Okay, we touched the cheese. Oh, we dragged the cheese on the bun. And then we take the other one. Oh, there we, we made our first burger. Okay, now we go lettuce here, tomato here, and then we combine. Look at that, Victor. You're doing such a great job. Ooh, this one's kind of tricky. We go cheese here, tomato, and then lettuce, and then we flip together, Victor. Wow. I think Victor hates his life now at this point. Well, oh, I forgot to add the... Ah, oh, I messed it up. Do I just lose now? What, what is this? I think I just lost. Well, Victor, your life sucks now. Goodbye.